What's going on, guys? Welcome back. This is going to be part 7 of the God Eater 3 series. And I do not know what I'm doing right now. <laughs> but it's actually pretty funny. Okay. So we're actually going to just jump right into the mission. By the way, I just want to say thank you guys all for the likes and support. If you're new to the channel, if this is your first time seeing my channel, go ahead and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you can stay updated with my latest content and everything. All that good stuff, you know? We're gonna just jump right into this next session. Urgent evasion notice. An aspirin was detected on our scheduled return route, so we have no choice but to swerve onto an unapproved route to avoid it. Use of Dusty Miller's weekends is avoidable. It's unavoidable. We are currently applying for official access. All right. All right. Also, guys, by the way, before I started this video, I was actually grinding just a little bit so I can boost the stats of, you know, the AIs and all that. I'll show you what I did for them after this mission. I basically all stacked them with, like, the same stats just for maximum effectiveness. You know. You know. With that being said, we're going to just jump right into this mission. Let's get it. God Eaters. Ash Powers refer to the mobile fortresses. Oh, wow. That was fast. Whoa. Well, okay. Well, okay. As you guys can see, I got me a new weapon. I know no, that weapon was just too slow for me, man. I can't. I can't deal, man. Oh, we got some big creatures here with us. It actually might be the last mission. Oh my god, what the fuck is that? No contact with Origami yet. Oh shit. Oh he's coming. He's coming over here. Hugo made contact with secondary target and is in pursuit. Made contact with secondary target and is in pursuit. Understood. I'm trying to snipe this guy. Why is my sniper not coming out? Here we go. Uh, oh. Get out the little guys first. Oh my god. Get rid of these little guys. Oh my god. Okay, he's shooting projectiles. Oh, this guy's dangerous. My, that felt good. That is an ugly creature, man. Hit me with his tail. Wow. Whoa! 
I dodged that. Come on, right, man. I think he's running. Oh shit, something's going on at the base, guys. Wow, he actually downed me. It's actually pretty weird how they're created. <laughs> What? 
There's one in the ship? Are you alright? <sighs> the container is... Don't be stupid. Think about yourself. Damn the cargo! Protecting that cargo is the duty entrusted to me. Uh, there is an ash origami in that container. Don't just waltz in there. Uh, what? Jesus! Is that a human? Hey, come on, wake up. Live, damn it. You have to live. Well, that was definitely an interesting way to start off part seven. Are they alive? You're awake. <sighs> Why did you have to worry me like that? Ma'am, our sleeping passenger awoke just now. Whoa, whoa. Take it easy. You've been out for three days. You've got quite a fan club now. <laughs> I would never have guessed that Gleipnir was using us to ship human cargo. I thought the reward was suspiciously generous, but I bought into it anyway. Is that kid human, or...? When the Ash Origami attacked, we recorded a huge resonance phenomenon emanating from the container. If we consider that this child was at the center... I saw it with my own eyes. Somehow, that kid did something that healed our friend's wounds. That sort of power goes well beyond human. Listen, Claire. All of the people you see here are authorized personnel. Could you at least tell us what you know about this? <laughs> she is the hope of humanity against the Ashlands. Huh? We were told the contents of that container could carry humanity into the future. That it was potential. So, according to Gleipnir, this girl is the hope of humanity. I was certain it had to be a new type of god arc, or something like that. Nevertheless, it is still my mission to safely deliver the container's contents, man. Please return to course and continue to mission HQ. Hold on, wait a sec. Are they gonna use that girl as a guinea pig or something? No way. That's not gonna happen. <sighs> she saved our comrade's life. Take it easy, Zeke. It's Claire's job, not ours. Come on, that's... I mean, yeah, but... <laughs> we are going to fulfill our contract. Let's set out towards Mission HQ as scheduled. The girl is already out, however, and the container is damaged beyond repair. There may have been a shipping accident, but she's still a passenger on my vessel. As such, we'll treat her as we would any passenger. How does that sound, Claire? My assignment is to deliver her safely to her destination. But I have no specific orders as to how she should be transported. Great! 
So, uh, do you think now we could stop calling her the girl or that kid or whatever? Huh? Why don't we think of a name for her then? So cute. What would be a good name for her? I'm really bad at this, so you decide. Theme. <laughs> oh, you like that one? It suits her nicely. Theme. It has a sweet sound to it. Theme. Theme. It definitely fits. Theme. <laughs> Are you happy with that name? Theme. Theme. <laughs> okay, so that wasn't weird. So is Fiends just gonna follow me around? Oh man, what is this? What is this? What? I'm not your dad! Oh my gosh, so I have a little fiend following me around that thinks I'm her dad. Great. This is just great. <laughs> that is definitely overbearing, man. <laughs> wow, thanks a lot, Hugo. Oh, this guy finally has something to say. Yo, what's wrong with everybody, man? I'm, everybody keep calling me the dad, like, Jesus. Not oh, cool. You keep at it, receptionist Amy. Alright, so I'm gonna go to the medical ward, I'm pretty sure. Oh my god, she's even running. Jesus Christ. This is so weird. Alright. Everybody wants to talk to me. Talk to me, man. I, I know I was out for a call. I guess I'm that important. Oh man, everybody was worried.
Whatever you say, Keith. Yo, stop calling me dad. Factor balance and metabolism are stable. Good. We should be alright. For the time being, at least. You heal incredibly quickly, even if you did get patched up by Feem. <laughs> it's something to be proud of. Right. She's really taken a shine to you. You're an intriguing character, to be sure. Hmm. Theme is. Huh? Sorry, it's nothing. <laughs> oh, 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 okay, I sense a little bit of jealousy here yeah, going on. another one of the locations Alrighty then theme you're with me I'm about to go check out boss lady oh container passage it's all fucked up, so I'm assuming I'm gonna go to the office. In the residential block. I mean, where else would she be? Whoosh! Sure. What's up, Hilda? Definitely talk to everybody already. I'm pretty sure for the most part. I'm just gonna go back to the bridge. Anybody on the bridge wanna talk? Pretty sure Amy has something to say. Okay, I'm definitely missing somebody I have to talk to. But, all right guys, that's gonna wrap it up for part seven. If you guys enjoyed, oops, oh man, sorry about that. If you guys enjoyed what you've seen, make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Let me know what else you guys would like to see. I'm definitely going to keep this series going, and I'm still weirded out by this new character, Theme. She's supposedly my stepdaughter. But yeah, guys, man, that's going to be all for this video. Definitely going to see ya next time.